in the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful, to whom we all have to turn back. Honorable listeners and respectable audience, you know that in linguistics we started the chapter that is known as pragmatics. In pragmatics we started the topic that was context and its types. In context I told you about linguistic context, uh, core text, physical context and epistemic context. Listeners and audience today our topic is about social context. What is social context? What is the importance of social context? And what are some examples of social context? Be with me and listen to this lecture from beginning until end. Listeners and audience, whenever we are talking about social context, social context refers to the relationship between the speakers and hearer. I am repeating. Social context refers to the relationship between the speakers and hearer. In other words, the relationship or the social relationship among the speakers and hearers, that kind of social relationship is called social context. You know, when people, they are living in a society, they know the culture, the language of each other. Even the dress code in uh, whatever the society have, the language, etc. So now, the social relation, when we are talking about the social Social refers to something that is pertaining or related to society. So, as I said, that social uh, context refers to the relationship among the speakers and hearer. Now, that is the example would be that social relationship or relation maybe uh, among friends, among teachers and among parents and children and that social relationship would be even uh, among teachers and students. Now, it depends upon the social relations uh, among people that what kind of relation they have. For example, if they have good relation good social relation definitely they would like to share information with each other they would like to sit with each other listen to each other etc for example if a, a person has a good relation good social relation with uh, his friends definitely if he is eating some food he will uh, beseech his friends he will invite his friends to come uh, his friends to come and participate even he will enjoy and take the test from that food well while he is uh, sitting with his friend because of that uh, social relationship with his friends on the contrary of that if the, that person he does not have a good social relation with his friends are those friends they do not have good social relations with that person so that person and those friends they would not like to for example to sit with each other and to even to invite each other uh, uh, eating and any other uh, conversation etc so this is the example of one example of social relation or social context another example is you know for example, uh, in a school, the children in the playground, they play with each other. They know that playground is, that is for playing with each other. Because they are class pillows, although they are from different classes, but they play with each other. But at the same uh, children, which are in the school, if they visit, a market or a bazaar definitely they will not play there 
Why? Because they know that bazaar is not a place for playing. It is a place for buying and selling, etc. So this is uh, today's topic, social context. So this topic about context and uh, its types is clear. We will uh, start, inshallah, by tomorrow, new topic and pragmatics.